This video discusses mechanical advantage systems. It provides the principles underlying their use, selection, and combination to form compound systems. There are three basic pulley system configurations. The 2 to 1 pulley system, the 3 to 1 Z rig, and block and tackle. Although the block and tackle receives a minor role, it should be given more consideration as an external hauling system, particularly in search and rescue situations. In a compound system, one system pulls on another. In the piggyback system, a two to one pulley system is pulling on a two to one system. In a nine to one double Z rig, a three to one Z rig is pulling on a three to one Z rig. A characteristic of compound systems is counting the number of supporting strands does not necessarily indicate the mechanical advantage of the system. The range of the system is the length of the hauling system from the anchor to where the system connects to the main line. Often the length of the system is limited by obstacles or space. Also, as the range of the system increases, the amount of rope needed to construct the system multiplies. Increasing the range of a 3 to 1 Z rig, one foot, absorbs an additional three feet of rope. Throw is defined as the distance the hauling system moves before it needs readjustment. The throw for the 4 to 1 piggyback is compared with the 5 to 1 system. Both are compound systems. Throw for the 4 to 1 piggyback is half the range of its system. The 5 to 1 system has a throw equal to the range of the system. To pull the same distance, the piggyback needs to be readjusted twice as often as the 5 to 1 system. In an internal system, the hauling line is part of the hauling system. The Z rig is normally an internal hauling system. In the external system, the hauling system acts upon a haul line. The piggyback system is designed to be rigged as an external system and not as an internal system. In contrast, the Z-Rig is normally rigged as an internal system, but if desired, it can be rigged as an external system. In pulley systems, when the angle between the anchor and the effort is 120 degrees, the force on the anchor, effort, and load are all the same. On the 2 to 1 system shown, there is no mechanical advantage. Angles greater than 120 degrees exert greater effort and when the angle approaches zero, maximum mechanical advantage is obtained. A directional pulley minimizes the angle between the anchor and the effort. This maximizes the mechanical advantage. In addition, the use of a directional pulley provides increased safety for the haulers since it allows them to safely stand off to the side of the hauling system in case the system fails. The self-adjusting brake is a Prusik fastened to the haul line that maintains tension on the haul line as the hauling system is readjusted for a new pull. Normally, the pulley stops the Prusik and slides it along the haul line. Care must be taken that the Prusik is not pulled through the pulley. Prusiks are used to attach the pulley system to the main line and create the self-adjusting brake. Prusiks are designed to be loosened and repositioned along the rope. This important feature enables the pulley system to continually be readjusted along the rope. The 2 to 1 system is depicted as an external system with a self-adjusting brake and directional pulley. Throw is equal to the range of the system one of the three basic systems, it is best used in the creation of compound systems with more mechanical advantage. The 3 to 1 Z rig is depicted as an internal system with a self-adjusting brake and directional pulley. Throw is equal to the range of the system. One of the three basic systems, it is best used in the creation of compound systems with more mechanical advantage. With the addition of another pulley, the 3 to 1 Z rig can be rigged as an external system. A compound system, the 4 to 1 piggyback system, is a 2 to 1 system pulling on a 2 to 1 system. It is depicted as an external system with a self-adjusting brake and directional pulley. A disadvantage throw is 
half the range of the system. A simple system, the 5 to 1 system, looks like a 2 to 1 system rigged in parallel with the 3 to 1 Z rig system. Actually, it is closer to the block and tackle using individual pulleys. Since one system is not pulling on another, it is listed as a simple system. It is depicted as an internal system. An advantage of the system is that the throw is equal to the range of the system. With an additional pulley, it can be rigged as an external system and offers an alternative to the piggyback system. A compound system, the 9 to 1 double Z rig, is a 3 to 1 Z rig pulling on another 3 to 1 Z rig. It is depicted as an internal system with a self-adjusting brake and directional pulley. Throw is sacrificed for mechanical advantage. It is one-third the range of the system. The 9 to 1 double Z rig can easily be converted to the 5 to 1 system. Remove the second pulley and prusik and clip the pulley to the first pulley. Conversely, the 5 to 1 system can be converted to a double Z rig. Simply remove the 2 to 1 pulley and add a prusik pulling on the first 3 to 1 Z rig. The block and tackle system is depicted as an external system with a self-adjusting pulley. In this configuration, it has all the advantages of other hauling systems that can be readjusted. Throw is the range of the system. If the tie-off is at the anchor end, the system has a 4 to 1 mechanical advantage. With the tie-off on the pulley at the load end, the system is a 5 to 1 system. A directional pulley may be added to avoid the impact of the 120 degree rule and to maximize mechanical advantage. If there are a few people to pull on the rope, there is a need for mechanical advantage. The 5 to 1 system provides good mechanical advantage. It has good throw and even with frictional losses, it still provides good mechanical advantage. Many rescue kits are built around the 3 to 1 Z rig. With frictional losses and the 120 degree rule, its mechanical advantage can easily approximate 2 to 1 or little mechanical advantage. Adding a directional pulley can help. Consider adding two pulleys and create the 5 to 1 system as the base system. Throw in another Prusik and you can easily convert the 5 to 1 into a 9 to 1 double Z rig. Now your rescue kit is complete. It provides you with multiple mechanical advantage options.